Hello, sports fans. I'm here again, Bob Zolke, Sportsman Z, and I'm here with the next series in the Stratomatic White Sox pre-play season, which will, as we know now, not even closely resemble the actual season, but we're already so far into it, I'm just going to keep it going. Today we're playing three against the Detroit Tigers. It's a divisional game, so I'm actually going to show it instead of skipping over it. So let's get going. And uh, these are the games of June 14th, so we're a little behind the actual date, but that's fine. Although apparently I only ha I have less than a month to get this season done because then real baseball starts. All right, so we got Kopech today. Oh, wait, we got to change this. The computer will be him, and we will be the human. And we got Kopech going up against Zimmerman. I'm, you know, I got to say here, I'm really expecting a sweep. Organization's terrible. Your organization's terrible. Let's go. Go ahead. Quiet. Quiet. I mean, this is Detroit, and it's Zimmerman going up against Kopech. But we'll see. The computer sometimes has other things in mind. Goodrum strikes out to lead off the first. Castro is going to single. So Harold Castro is aboard. Going to pitch to Cabrera. And he does try to make it. And he makes it. And he goes all the way to third. So not good. But there's a strikeout to Cabrera. So all we got to do is get this last guy out. Crone, and Crone hits a ground ball at Tinier, and he gets him. So nobody scores, even though Goodrum did manage to get to third base. Tim Anderson up, and he is going to ground out. And also, as I mentioned before um, in some of the videos, I will cut down and edit the video wherever I can. Potentially, if it makes sense, uh, to cut out innings where there aren't isn't a lot of scoring because we are trying to get three games on to one um, one video. So we will have Robert try to steal, and I'm still going to have that, and he does make it. So we got a man on second with one out and Moncada up, and he singles, and maybe. Robert can score. Yeah, I'm going to send him 80%. You know that. And I'm even going to send the trailing runner. And a trailing runner, uh, he threw for the guy at the plate and got him. Unreal. And then there's a strikeout. So that's it. We didn't score. So Chris Stewart is going to be out. Jonathan Scope up, and he is flying out. And that brings up Candelario, and he strikes out. So Abreu is up against Zimmerman, and he flies out. That brings up Grandall. And Grandall is going to be out. And Mazzara is up and swinging away. And he is going to hit a home run potentially if it's not robbed. Yes. It's gone. Nice. So that puts us on the board with a run, and Lurie Garcia comes up, and he strikes out. That brings up Ronnie Rodriguez. I know Ronnie very well. I have him on one of my strat teams. And he is going to be out. That brings up Grayson Griner. The guy's, I love this guy's name. I wish I had him in some of my leagues. And now Nico Goodrum is up, and he is out. Lines out. So that's 
So we maintain the one nothing lead and take it to the bottom of the third with Hernandez up, and he is going to Gorky. Hernandez is going to single. And uh, let's see if he can steal. I don't even know. I'm going to still try it at 60. No, he's out. Easily gunned. Anderson up, and he strikes out. And then that brings up Lewis Robert, who is swinging away and going to be out. So Harold Castro is leading off for Detroit here at the top of the fourth, with Detroit losing one nothing. Kopech pitching great, which is nice to see. Miguel Cabrera is up, and he is going to hit a single. There was a possibility of a triple there, but no. That brings up C.J. Crone, who is probably the most dangerous hitter, except for possibly a scope in this Detroit lineup, and he's out. And that brings up Chris Stewart. And uh, Chris Stewart, that was a pass ball, and so Chris Stewart walks. So now Kopech has a little bit of an issue. There's two men on with two outs and scope up. And he's hit by pitch. So now the bases are loaded. And that brings up Candelario, and it looks like it's going to be a pass ball that's going to let the tying run score. And then there's a strikeout. But they score on a pass ball or a wild pitch or whatever it was. So Moncada's up. And he gets a catcher card X. And he's out. And Canarcion is up. And he lines out, and that brings up Abreu. And Abreu is going to hit a double. So that brings up Grandall trying to knock him in, and not going to. He gets it out, lines out. So the score remains 1-1, going to the top of the fifth. And Ronnie Rodriguez leading off, and he's out. Grayson Griner is going to strike out in his column. And that brings up Nico Goodrum, and he is going to ground out. So we go to the bottom of the fifth, tied 1-1. Can't seem to break through on the crappy Zimmerman. And we hit the ball at Crone. And he makes the play. Lurie Garcia is up with one out. And he hits a catcher card. X to Griner. And he makes the play. And so there's two down with Gorky's up. And Gorky's is out. So we go to the top of the sixth. In a 1-1 game. Where both pitchers are strangely pitching great. Now Kopech I would expect that from. Zimmerman, I would not. Melky Cabrera is up, and he is going to single. Or Miguel, Miguel Cabrera, not Melky. Crone is up, and he strikes out. So there's two down here in the first game, the sixth inning of the first game, and we're tied 1-1 with Detroit. And Chris Stewart is up, and he walks. We seem to have trouble with this part of the lineup. And then Scope pops out. So we're going to the bottom of the sixth. Timmy Anderson, top of the order, up, and he strikes out. Lewis Robert is up. And he is going to ground out that first. And that brings up Moncada, swinging away. And he's going to double. And that seems to be a running thing. Double with two down for us, which doesn't help if the next guy can't get a hit. And that's in Canarcion in this case. And he singles. Let's see if Moncada can score on it. Send him at 95. Watch him get gunned. 
No, he didn't. So, all right, we got a two to one lead now. Thank you. Abreu is up. And he's going to double. And that is not going to score in Canarsie. Oh, no way. I will send him to third, though, because it was 70% chance. And now Zimmerman's tired. Let's see if they take him out. They do. They brought in Hardy. So Grandall up against Hardy. Hits a ground ball short. That's Ronnie Rodriguez. Let's see if he can throw it into the stands. No, he's out. So we only have the two to one lead here in the top of the seventh. And there's a fly ball to left, which is not good. Oh, yeah, it is. Hernandez is good. All right, Gorky's, he's not bad. Yeah. Ronnie Rodriguez is going to fly out. Almost had a double, but not quite. And that brings up Grayson Griner. And they're going to pinch hit Dixon for him. And Dixon's going to be out. So we go to the bottom of the seventh. We got a 2-1 lead. The slimmest of margins. And Mazzara up. And Mazzara flying out. Still, they still have Hardy in to pitch. Lurie Garcia up. And he's going to home run. No, he's going to triple. No, he's going to double. What is he going to do? Single. I guess he doesn't have the power to hit a home run. So Gorky's is up. And Gorky's is going to line out to, for the second out. So two down with Garcia at first and Tim Anderson up, and he singles. So we got a chance here because we got Moncada coming up next, and I'm going to try to take the extra base. And so, or Lewis Robert up, and he's out. So. We're going to make some defensive replacements here, and we're going to make a pitching change. So let's see. Madrigal's going in at second. Um, Engel is going to go in. Um, in right. Yeah, actually, that's easy. And then we're going to bring in Fry to pitch for Kopech. And there is going to be a line out by Goodrum, their leadoff hitter. Here in the top of the eighth, Harold Castro up, and he walks. Cabrera is up. And striking out. So now they've got two down with Harold Castro at first and Crone at the plate, and he is out. So Fry gets us out of it. We maintain the two to one lead with Moncada up. And Moncada singling to lead us off. Good sign. Uh, let's see. I should try to steal. I'm not going to attempt it when it goes down to 20%, though. So Encarnacion is striking out for the first out. Moncada still at first and Abreu up. That'll be a pass ball. So Abreu is still up at the plate. And he's going to hit a two-run home run. And now I don't think we have to worry. I think we can breathe a sigh of relief. Let's hope. So it is now four to one, us. And Grandall is up. And he's walking. So Buck Farmer, like, really just came in and threw gasoline all over the place. Angle is up, and they're probably going to take Farmer out, I would guess. And they do, and they bring in Alcantara to face uh, Angle, who is potentially hitting a home run, and he is. And now we can really breathe a sigh of relief. Now I might as well just keep frying. Madrigal is up, and he's going to be out for the second out. 
So we got a six to one lead, and Gorky's is at the plate and hits a ground ball to Candelario. And that's it. So we go to the ninth. Chris Stewart is up. Christian Stewart to face Fry, the Fry guy. That's going to be a single. Scope is up with him at first. Ground ball to the pitcher. Let's hope Fry plays it. And he does. Runner moves to second, but that's really inconsequential with the lead we've got. And Candelario walks. And that brings up Ron Ronnie Rodriguez, and he strikes out. So that's a second out of the ninth. We're one out away from winning game one of this series. And he's going to bring up Cameron Mabin. And Mabin is going to hit the ball to right. And I made the defensive replacement, so Angle is there and should play the ball. And that's it. We won. I mean, for a while there, it looked touch and go. Near the end, it was apparent. Kopech going seven, giving up only one earned run and getting the win. And Fry going two and giving up no earned runs. So that takes us to game two of the series. And uh, let's see what we got here. We've got Gio going up against Ivan Nova, the former White Sox. And I am going to go with the lineup that they give us. Like I said, I expect to win all three of these games. And it would be very helpful if we could. Goodrum strikes out to lead off the top of the first. Harold Castro is up. He hits the ground ball to short, and that's Timmy Anderson there. And it's a single. It got past Anderson, so Cabrera's up. And Cabrera's going to hit a single. So two on, one out, Scope at the plate, and Scope is going to hit a three-run home run. Not good. So Geo is down real quickly here, and then we got Mercer hitting a, just ripping a plain double. Yeah, it's not looking good for Gio. Then there's a fly ball to right for the second out. Andrew Romine flying out for Detroit. And that brings up Brandon Dixon. And he walks. So Gio is just having all kinds of big problems. And then uh, John Hicks is going to line out. But Detroit struck for three. And uh, that's going to be a problem, potentially. But let's see what we can do against Nova. Anderson is out. Lewis Robert. He is going to be out. And that brings up Moncada, swinging away. And he's going to probably be out. Yeah. So we go to the top of the second. We're losing 3 nothing. Fly ball for Candelario. That brings up Nico Goodrum, and he singles. He's got some speed, so we'll have to watch him. I don't know. We were watching him. Okay, so that's 95 even with the watch. Um, I'll just let him go. Castro is up with uh, Nico at second. And that was a pass ball, of course, and here's going to be another one. So they're going to score on a stolen base and two pass balls and make it 4 nothing. And then Castro gets out. Thank you. And Cabrera is out. And Cabrera is out. But we go to the top of the third. Trying to get, uh, knowing that we have to get four runs in this game, at least to be tied. Abreu is up with an Encarnacion on and no outs, and he hits a fly ball.
Then bring the brand doll. And brand doll is gonna fly out. My goodness, this. All right. And then Jimenez is gonna hit a single. I'll send in Canarcion, even though it really isn't worth it. And then Mazzara is up, and he's going to hit a ground ball. So we didn't get any runs there. We need to really hope for a big inning. We've got to have a big inning. Hit by pitch by scope. Mercer is up, and Mercer's going to hit a fly ball. So there's one down with Andrew Romine up, and he's flying out. And that brings up Brandon Dixon. And he is going to hit a double, which may score scope. We'll see. It doesn't, though. And then Hicks is up and striking out. So at least he got out of that inning. And not allowing any more runs, even though he came very close. Lurie Garcia up at the plate, striking out. Tim Anderson is going to hit a fly ball to center. He's a four, so that could be a double. Or a triple, or a whatever. Couldn't get to it, so it is a double. And then Lewis Robert is up, and he is going to hit a single. Definitely welcome. I'm going to send Anderson because we need to score. And we do. So it's 4-1. to one. Mancata up. He hits a ground ball to second, but that's scope. So he should play into a double play even. And he does. So we get out of the inning, but it's a good thing I sent Anderson on that one. Uh, play so we, it's four to one, and then they lead off with a single. Gonzalez just can't seem to. Uh, this is not his day. He can't seem to get people out. Although we don't really have a good bullpen, so Goodrum is going to hit a double though. No outs. Runners at second and third, and that's a strikeout. So that was key. Cabrera is up. And that's going to be a line out. And hopefully nobody will score. And Scope is up. And he walks to load him up. Here in the fourth. Mercer at the plate. And he's going to be out. So he just escapes again by the skin of his butt. And we are still down four to one, and Canarcion up at the plate. And that's going to be a ground ball. Abreu is up and maybe hitting a home run. Let's hope. I think that's a home run. Let's just call that right now. So we're scratching our way back. It's now four to two. Grandall is up at the plate. And he strikes out. And that brings up Jimenez. And he strikes out. But we got another run. So now we've cut the deficit uh, 4 to 2. Single from Roma, but Gonzalez just continues to suck, and I really need as many innings out of him as I can get. There's a strikeout for Dixon, so that helps. Romine at first, one out, Hicks it up, and Hicks hits a double. God. All right, two on, one out, and then there's a ground ball to second base. That's Garcia, and that gets through for a base hit, so they get two on that. Now, now I might as well just let him finish out this inning. He walks the next guy. I mean, you know, this is, it, it's going to be, yeah. he walks Castro. One out. 
Need a double play. No. Cabrera hits a single. All asterisks. Well, now we might as well just let him finish the game because we're not going to win this. It's eight to two now. So, um, unless we go completely off the rails on, uh, I mean, there's a home run by Mazzara, and that's nice. Would have been nicer if we had been able to hold the score to four to two and make it four three right now, but instead it's eight to three. So Garcia's up and he's gonna fly out. That brings up Timmy A, who is out. See, scoring one run at a time right now is not going to help us. We need like a huge inning. And I am going to let Gonzalez pitch again. And that's going to be a single for Mercer instead of a strikeout because he's tired. That's going to be a double. I mean, there's just, you know, you played Stratomatic as long as I have. You know that there's just no need to burn through your bullpen in a game like this. Now, in real life, you know, Gonzalez would probably be you know, pretty upset with me, but we're not dealing with real life here. And Candelario is up and he's going to be out. So he does get us out of this inning too, even despite the fact he was tired. And that brings up Moncada. Moncada is going to fly out. And Canarcion walks a brave who is up and he is going to be out lining out to dixon and that brings up the grand doll and grand doll is going to also be out lining out in this case the scope so uh the question is do i keep Gonzalez going, probably not. So I'm going to go to the pen and we're going to get um, Banuelos. And for those of you out there that are um, may know, may or may not know, Banuelos is actually no longer on the White Sox roster, but I'm keeping him anyway because of, you know, I mean, I need the manpower on the bullpen and in the game, and we, and we've come this far, so I'm not going to change that. So there's one out for Detroit with Cabrera up and a man at second, and he's going to hit a single, which should score a good run. I mean, let's, oh no, I'm going to throw for the lead runner, and maybe it won't, and it doesn't. He's out. And scope is up. And that is going to be a fly ball. So Benuelos gets us out of the inning because of a great throw by Lewis Robert to the plate to nail a run. But it doesn't matter. I mean, we're not going to win the game. Jimenez is up. And he's going to fly out. Mazzara is up. And he's going to hit a single. But again, the score is eight to three, so we need five runs, just a tie. And that's going to be a strikeout. There's two down in the seventh. And Tim Anderson up and striking out. So that brings up Jordy Mercer. Going to keep Benuelos out there. He walks him. Andrew Romine is up, and he's going to hit into a double play. Thank you. The pitcher's best friend and really the manager's best friend as well, a double play. And Brandon Dixon is going to be out. So Detroit 
gets uh, Benuelos gets us out of that inning. We're going to the bottom of the ninth, or the bottom of the eighth. Sorry, excuse me. Needing five runs, and that's going to be a home run by Lewis Robert. So that's good. But now it's still eight to four. Now we need four runs. Moncada up. And he's going to hit a single. So let's see if we can put something together here. And Canarcion up at the plate. And he hits into a double play. Thank you. You and Canarcio. And Abreu up at the plate. Would be nice if we got a home run here, but no. We get a ground ball. Okay, so um, might as well let Ben Wheeler finish it out. I mean, he can. He's got these uh, starter relievers. So, uh, yeah, but that's a double. Runner at second, Candelario up, and he strikes out. So down by four, Goodrum up with a man at second, and he's going to knock the guy home. And hit a double himself. So now it's nine to four. We're down by five again. There's a walk for Castro. Yeah, Benuelos is tied. I knew that was coming, but. You know, at this point, doesn't really matter. And then Cabrera hits a three-run homer. Oh, yeah, I'm having a blast. Thanks. Good. God, sucker teed off in that like he knew I was going to throw a fastball. He did know. Wow. I told him. And that brings up Scope. And Scope is out. So that's a second out. And up steps Mercer. And Mercer is going to hit a double. Mercer's been really on fire today. This, he's three for four with two doubles. And Romine up at the plate and flying out. Although it is a home run. Oh no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 So, he didn't fly out. And Dixon hits a single. Hicks is up. And Hicks hits a home run. So this is like a real uh, epically bad pitching performance here by Benuelos. I pitched better on my bad days. And Candelario is out. So. That does it, but they got eight runs there, so really, we're not winning this game. And that's going to be a fly out for Grand Dahl. We're one down. I just want us to get out as quickly as possible, and let's go home, hit the showers, and get ready for game three. Jimenez strikes out. And Mazzara is up at the plate and lines out. So that's going to be it. Take a quick look at the box score. It's going to be ugly. Gonzalez, six innings, 14 hits, eight earned runs, walked four. And allowed a home run. Benuelos, three innings pitched, eight earned runs, eight hits, three walks, three home runs. And Gonzalez on the year now has a 526 earned run average, but he's four and nine. So let's go to game three and let's hope we take two out of three from him. I mean, really, I mean, we're talking about Detroit here. So we got Keuchel going against Matt Boyd and actually Matt Boyd is their best pitcher. So it isn't like this game should be easy. I'm going to put Madrigal or is it Mendick? I'm going to put um, Mendick in at second. And uh, yeah, everything else will be the same. 
So let's hope we can beat Detroit in game three. Goodrum leading off. He lines out for the first out of the game. Ronnie Rodriguez is going to be out. And that brings up Miguel Cabrera. And he's going to be out. So we come up to the plate leading off with Timmy Anderson in the bottom of the first. And he hits a single. Nice way to start, although Boyd's a negative six watch. So we're not going to try to go anywhere on him. And Engel hits a fly ball. And Moncada's up. And that's going to be a pass ball that moves Anderson second. One out. Moncada up with a man at second, and he flies out. And that'll bring up Encarnacion, and Encarnacion strikes out. So we go to the top of the second with C.J. Crone leading off and striking out. To Keuchel. Scope facing Keuchel, and he is going to line out. Nice to see the rolls not going Detroit's way here in game three. But Dixon hits a double. And that brings up Candelario, and he flies out. So we're out of the second inning, still in a tie game. Abreu up, and he walks. So let's start something. Come on, let's start something. Grandall up at the plate and lining out. Jimenez up, up, and he's going to be lining out. Or ground, ground, ball, ground ball double play. Even worse. Or no, it's not a double play. Hmm. All right, two down, Zara up, and he strikes out. So we go to the top of the third. Hicks leading it off for Detroit. Hits the ball second. I got Mendick over there, but I don't know if he'll make it. He doesn't. He allows the hit. So Stewart, Christian Stewart is up, and he's going to hit into a double play. So that brings you very much, Stewart. And that brings up Nico Goodrum, and Goodrum is out. So we do escape the third inning. Detroit getting nothing in the third. And up steps Mendick, and Mendick is going to hit the ball. Let's go. Might be a single. Let's see. No, he's out. Anderson's up, and Anderson's out. And that brings up Engel. And Engel is going to hit a ground ball at short. That's Ronnie Rodriguez. He may be hitting a board. Yes. And that brings up Moncada, who could hit a home run, but no, he doesn't. But he hits it at Rodriguez again. Again, Rodriguez is horrible at shortstop, but this time he makes the play. And look who leads off, Ronnie Rodriguez. And he's going to foul out to the catcher. Brings up Cabrera. Hits the ball down to Abreu at first. And that's an out. And uh, yeah, Keiko was injured there, but he can remain in the game. And Crone is up. And hitting the ball at Timmy Anderson, who should make the play. And he's out. So, no, he isn't. He beats it out. All right. Scope is up with a man at first and two down and strikes out. So, we go to the bottom of the fourth. Let's go, guys. Come on. Encarnacion. Encarnacion walks. Abreu is up. And Abreu is hitting the ball at short. That's Ronnie. And he got the uh, batter out, but Encarnacion moves to second on that, and Grandal's up. And he hits a ground ball to second base C, which is going to move Encarnacion to third. 
But now we got two down and Jimenez up at the plate and we needed something there and we didn't get it. He struck out. So we're in a 0-0 game. I'm just going to let everybody know this is the perfect game. This is the kind of game that I would move right to the end of the game. There's no other scoring. Uh, Candelario. Candelario is out. That's two down. Here in the top of the fifth. And Hicks is up. And Hicks hits a single off of Keichel. Brings up Christian Stewart. And he is going to hit the ball at Tim Anderson. Let's hope he makes the play. He does. So Mazaris is going to come up for us to lead off the bottom of the fifth. And that's going to be an out. Mendick up. Mendick strikes out. And that brings up Tim Anderson. And he's going to be out. So we are going to the top of the six. No score here. And Goodrum starts off with a, with a brown ball to Anderson that looks like he's not going to be able to. And he doesn't. And so Goodrum is safe. And that's going to be a single by Rodriguez. So now they got two runners on with no outs. And Cabrera up. And Cabrera strikes out. So thank goodness. Thank Goodrum. Crone is up. And he hits the ball at. Anderson, let's hope he plays it. And he does play it for a double play, no less. So we got Engel leading off for us in the bottom of the sixth and hitting the ball at shortstop, who is Ronnie Rodriguez. You would think he would get on, but he doesn't. Moncada. Moncada strikes out. Again, the boy just pitching his butt off. And Encarnacion walks. That brings up a brave and a brave strikes out. So we're going to the top of the seventh uh, fans and it's 0-0 zero, zero here between us and Detroit and Scope leads off on the second. That brings up Dixon, Brandon Dixon and he hits a single double asterisk possibly. And Keiko's tired. All right, well, let's see if he can get through this. He can't. All right, I'm going to have to go to the bullpen. Um, bring in C Shack to stop everything right now. Hicks is up, and he's going to strike out and be injured. That brings up Christian Stewart, and he walks. Detroit scores, and they're up one nothing. and then there's a strikeout by Goodrum, so there's two down. And that brings up Ronnie Rodriguez, and he hits the ball at second. That's Mendick, and he may not play the ball. No, he did, though. Okay, good. So they only, they got one run. I mean, we need a run to win a game anyway, so if we can't get a run off, boy, we're in trouble. Grandall now, though, facing Farmer, not Boyd anymore. And that he hits ground ball to third. Candelario isn't that great. But he makes the out. Jimenez is up. You would think we could get a, like a solo home run. Something. Jimenez flies out, though. And that brings up Mazzara. And Mazzara strikes out. So we're going to keep c -Shack in. He pitched well last time, and he, uh, in fact, he's his last couple of times I brought him in, he's pitched well. So, And he gets the second out with Crone, so there's two down here in the eighth. And let's go up at the plate and catch your card X. That's Grandall. And we got him. So he gets out of that, and then Mendick comes up. And Mendick hits a double. Nice. Now I got to decide, what are we going to do? Are we going to sacrifice Mendick over to third? No, we're not with Anderson because he's a really good hitter. 
He hits the ball at Crone at first. Let's see if he can get it by Crone. He doesn't, but he does move Mendick over to third, and Engel is up and striking out. And that brings up Moncada, and he strikes out. So we can't get the tying run there, even though we came very close. I'm going to bring in Evan Marshall because C-Sheck is probably close to tired, and Dixon, he leads off against Dixon, and he flies out. Candelario is up, and he's going to hit a ground ball to second. And that brings up Hicks. And Hicks is out. So we need one run right here in the bottom of the ninth. And Encarnacion, he's a guy that could give it to us, but he doesn't. He pops out. Or will. Abreu is up. And he ties the game with a home run. Abreu tying the game. Thank you, Mr. Abreu. And Grandall is up at the plate. He could he could send us home. And he doesn't. Two down, Jimenez up. And I'm gonna have him swing away. And he walks. And that brings up Mazzara. And he ground balls B, but we are going to extras. And we're going to free baseball. Marshall's still out there against Christian Stewart, but he walks Christian Stewart. That brings up Goodrum. Goodrum walks. That brings up Ronnie Rodriguez. Ronnie Rodriguez strikes out, thank God. One down, two on. Cabrera up, and he is going to be out. Ground ball B. So they'll have runners at the corners with two down. And Crone up at the plate. And hopefully Grandall plays this. But he doesn't. So Detroit takes another lead. Crone striking out. So we're in now in the bottom of the 10th and we have to get another run. We have got to have a run and Mendick singles. Tim Anderson up, and they're going to make a pitching change, and they're going to go to Jimenez, and he strikes out Anderson. Engel is up. I don't know that I'm going to let Engel hit. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to hit Garcia here. And he just misses getting a sting. And Moncada is up at the plate in our last hope, and he singles. Which brings up Ben Canarsino. And he is going to be out, and we lose. Unbelievably, we lose two games to Detroit. They're 25 and 56, and we're 44 and 38. So that's it for me. Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.